Uh, go. Alright, hi, assalamualaikum and a very good morning, guys. And today we would like to make uh, one experiment, what we call is a MG measurement. The MG stands for electromyogram. Alright, uh, for today we have a uh, KL72001 and this is a EMG uh, module. And so this is our subject. Okay, for our subject we use a uh, three electrode. Uh, which is located at uh, the, the, the lower muscle and the upper muscle and this uh, for the channel 2 which uh, means for uh, the uh, reference graph uh, which is this is uh, channel 2 and this is for channel 1 that we use a 2 electron alright uh, now we go to straight forward, which is uh, we will make uh, the experiment. For the first task, we need to uh, know the isotonic constriction muscle. So, uh, what we need to do is uh, the subject needs to bend the elbow 90 degree, and then we will put a 5 kilogram dumbbell on the hand. So. And then, as you can see, it's a uh, will spiking up the uh, graph. All right. And then we go to the uh, second task, which is uh, the subject you need to lift the dumbbell uh, 90 degree about two seconds and put it down repeatedly for three times. This is for isotonic contraction measurement. Awesome. All right. Good. All right. Okay. As you can see, the graph is waking up, and when he, when he in a relaxed time. All right. You can see that. Yeah. The the, the muscles are in a contact. Okay, and then we go to the last task, which is uh, the subject need to uh, lift up the dumbbell, and then until the it fatigue occur, right? So this is what we call a muscle fatigue measurement. Okay, as you can see. The subject need to wait until uh, he fatigue. So yeah, this is what graph that we want. It's out of the range, and then it's a very high uh, measurement. This is because uh, the muscles are contract. Yeah, if you can see from the beginning, in the in early stage, the graph is very uh, low, and for now, at the end of the experiment, you can see the range of the graph is very high. So, guys, uh, that's all for today. Thank you for watching uh, our video. Hope it can be uh, a knowledge for us that we can be share to another people. Alright, so thank you so much. See you next time.